Good morning, everybody. We, today we uh, went out to the uh, Halifax River. It's the intercoastal. We're over here at uh, Port Orange, Florida. And we flew the uh, Mavic Air and did a little video on this morning. Uh, it was a nice morning out. It was warm. The humidity was, uh, was you know, pretty high there, but it's Florida. Florida in the summertime. So we did some nice flying over top the river here this morning. You'll see several times there's some birds in the air, and uh, I believe most of them was herrings. Uh, I did see one blue herring. I uh, don't think it showed up here into this video there, but uh, a lot of wildlife there in the mornings. we pan down here we're panning to the south here and this park here that you see coming up on the screen is brand new they have this round thing here like a walk that goes up to it I'm not sure the idea of it but it just kind of goes around in a circle and goes to the top that's all brand new this is looking north uh, it'd be South Daytona and on up would be course Daytona Beach the water was uh, really calm this morning. The uh, sometimes the intercoastal can get get pretty choppy, but this morning it was really nice and calm. This guy here, he's uh, decided he went to go out fishing a little bit, so uh, he got his pole. He's heading out to uh, one of the boat docks there and uh, going to try his luck. Um, they catch all kinds of things in the river, everything from sharks to red snapper to blues and uh, all kinds of good fishing out there in the river. I think morning time is a good time for a lot of people will uh, go out and do their fishing and uh, he'll uh, think he ends up going all the way out to the end of the dock. These are actually private docks uh, that they uh, own. Someone asked me, uh, does these people take these boats out much? And uh, not really from what I've seen. Once in a while they take them out, but they don't. There's a bird flying by, I believe that was a, uh, a herring. You'll see a few birds on the rail, and those are just uh, seagulls. Those are uh, predator birds. They all eat anything you can present to them, including your bait. I was having to shoot into the sun this morning because uh, that's the side of the river we was on, and the sun was rising over the ocean. Yeah, it had been a nice morning to be out on the water. The... Uh, well, I said hardly any waves at all. Water was very smooth there, so it made for a nice, relaxing ride. Scanning over this uh, area over here, uh, this used to be a dock for a restaurant. Uh, it's a marina and a restaurant there. It was called uh, uh, Captain Daddy's. They used to have a um, paddle boat here. And uh, you could go on the paddle boat and have lunch. You could have some drinks. And it was really, really nice. Uh, don't believe they ever took it out. But the paddle boat got destroyed during Hurricane Matthew. This is looking south down towards the city of Port Orange, Florida. We only flew up only about 50 feet this morning we didn't take it very high the uh, Mavic Air is pretty new to us and so we've been a little more cautious with it but we'll be expanding our sh shots here as we get used to it this is scanning over to the west that is 1A1 and it uh, goes all the way up from uh, Maine to Key West and uh, this coming up here is a, uh, a nice picture of the new park. Uh, they had just, there was another park there, and they tore it up, and I was afraid they'd destroy it because it was a nice park, but uh, hadn't been over for a while, and they've rebuilt the park. Nice walk that goes around there. We drove over there after we took the shot and checked it out, and it's all brand new. Nice to have the restroom facilities there. I still can't figure out the circular walk, what the idea of that was. Anybody has any ideas, leave a comment. This is looking all the way up north to Daytona Beach. There's some condos on uh, this side of the river too. I 
there's some islands out there into the intercoastal that uh, a lot of people will dock their boats and go out and explore the islands. And you, of course, see all the condos over on the beach side. There's some different areas right in here where the oysters are. And uh, I always heard that uh, you wouldn't want to collect oysters north of uh, Oak Hill, which is uh, south of there. Well, they... Uh, I've seen a uh, commercial fisherman, he was uh, actually doing some collecting up in there, so they must be safe to eat. You have to be careful with oysters and the bacteria that's in them. And back around, here's another view of the new park. We'll have to check out this park some more, maybe fly the drone here again, maybe take some uh, other videos there at the park. Got a lot of nice parks in the county. This whole area is called Riverwalk. Uh, it was by the city of Port Orange that they were developing it. And it's been a long time in coming, but they're slowly developing it for shops and restaurants and marinas up through here. And uh, sooner or later, it's going to be a nice area there, but they've still got some uh, improvement to do. The hurricane has set them back. We had two hurricanes, uh, Matthew and uh, Irma, uh, kind of set things back for a little bit. We're uh, panning down uh, to the south again there, coming up on the uh, where the uh, Captain Daddy's restaurant was. And uh, I have a picture here that I uh, put up what it uh, looked like and what the riverboat looked like before the uh, hurricane destroyed it. We had to pull our motorcycle down there and uh, took some uh, pictures of it with the motorcycle in the background. It'll be uh, coming up here in a minute. There's the motorcycle and there's the restaurant that was Captain Daddy's and we had rode our motorcycle down there at one point and I couldn't find a video of a picture of it after it was destroyed somewhere. Uh, I could probably locate that but uh, it didn't end up at the end of that grassy area. Uh, it really destroyed the boat and uh, it hasn't been replaced since then so it was quite uh, quite nice. It's a real shame uh, the destruction that hurricanes can do uh, in the area. But when you live in the tropics, uh, you tend to get a hurricane now and then. We actually uh, brought our road trek out here this morning. Uh, we had all the convenience of home there. We uh, have the generator in it with the AC and all our facilities. Uh, and so we uh, stopped at this little park here. This actually was a marina. And uh, we hung out here for about an hour or so. Did some drone shots and uh, I have a live morning coffee chat. We did that right from here too. So uh, it was just a nice nice Saturday morning uh, to come. It was again a little bit warm. But uh, like I said again this is Florida. This is uh, uh, July. Florida in July is, is warm. We come back around here, we'll uh, give you a view of our road trek. A handy little uh, van. Has everything in it, from a shower to a bathroom. It's got AC, a generator on it. We use it quite a bit just locally around. We have solar hooked up to it. We run our refrigerator off for solar. This is a uh, 2001 road trek. It's a uh, 190. Uh, Versatile 190. We've had it for a couple years now. And so we've used it quite a bit. It's due for a cleaning. I got a little lax on uh, keeping it washed up there, so it's really due for a cleaning and waxing. Maybe when the weather cools down. So we pan up and take a view. You can see our solar panels on top. And uh, let's just say. Uh, it's a really nice morning here at the river. Well, as we get uh, ready to leave you with our little, our little trip out to the Halifax River this morning. I hope you enjoyed this video. We try to provide uh, good quality content and. Uh, with the uh, new Mavic Air, uh, I'm getting some really nice shots with it there, so I'm hoping to give you more in the future. 
If you enjoyed it, uh, hey, do us a favor and give us a thumbs up. And uh, any comments you'd like to leave, leave them in the comments section below. And uh, so glad to have everybody uh, stop by. If you're not a subscriber, I invite you to hit the subscribe button. Absolutely free. And thank you for watching our uh, little video today. It was fun bringing it to you. We'll see you guys the next time.